What is up? Welcome back. This is the new bench. And it's large. Today, we're gonna do our first unboxing on it. And what do we got? The TRX-6 Ultimate RC Hauler. Awesome. Let's get right into it. You know how we open things here. We don't read boxes. You can get that info somewhere else. We just get into it. Looks like that's the back. Here's the front. around this is probably the radio what's going on here come right up there what do we got Yep, that's the radio. You know what's cool is this one is your regular top qualifier radio, two speed diffs, and then this one is link enabled. It's already got the link in it so pretty sweet there but that's not why we're here we're here for this oh another cross wrench nice never have too many of them i have too many of them that off to the side so this one the early ones I don't think came with it this one's got the winch installed let's undo some cable ties One. Is there another one in the front? Oh yeah, I can feel it up here. We'll go down. Up and out of there. More trash. Certainly hoping that I'm not throwing things away. Looks like we got a couple of bobby pins. Plastic junk. More trash. 
see here. Is this just going to come off of there? There we go. So, unwrap the body here. It is Lexan, which is kind of lame. But that's a Traxxas thing. They do Lexan. Cab lights. I don't even know. Can you guys see that? It's pretty sweet. Let's set that off to the side. Let's drag this up here. More plastic protective film here. That's off of there. Bumper. And let's go to the other side. And boom, there it is. Looks like we've got our remote rubber banded here to the battery tray. We don't need that, but very nice. For the winch, the winch is mounted here on the bed. Very nice. Push button for free spool. Very cool. Um, here's some information on the SC. Two standard XL5. Not too much to worry about. Lots of lights in there. Let's put this. Lots of lights in there. thing's big look at that very cool it's got six by six with all this kind of black chrome scale details um, in here are some rubber bands for these wheel chocks on the bed. Let's see how... Uh... Oh, how's the Galande 2 like, fit on this thing? I know the bed's not right for like... See, that fits perfect. Yeah, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. What about the TF3? Yeah, that fits good too. Nice. 
So, yeah, let's uh, let's get a look at it here. Let, I got a battery charged. This will run on two or three S. Here's your typical three cell, five thousand. What's this thing supposed to run on? The battery tray don't even fit in there. Or this battery doesn't fit in the battery tray. That's pretty beat. What else do we need? We need batteries in this transmitter. This is telling you to use low gear whenever you've got a load on the bed or if you're off-roading it. It's kind of interesting. So anyway, let's supply some power to this thing. Kind of bomb this Traxxas 5000 don't fit. certainly looks like it should actually I don't know anyway transmitter on truck on Diff lockers. Power. It's kind of set to a different uh, So we got our front lights, headlights, markers, cab lights, all these lights along the bed. Those lights on the headache rack don't appear to be working right now. I got tail lights. What's going on there? There, now they're on. Um, let's check this thing out here. This must be the battery saver. Pull that out. Nice. Remote winch. Nice of them too. If 
factory install that. Very cool. So, I've got some ideas for this thing. So, you're going to have to stay tuned to the channel to see what's next. That's going to do it for this one. Thanks for watching. This is my new TR TRX6 RC hauler. We'll see you in the next one.